obviously to my good friend, Assemblywoman Cheryl Brown. Uh, it was mentioned earlier, right? Sometimes standing up for the right thing or standing up for some of the things we hear about every single day, which is how are we growing the economy? How are we putting food on the table? How are we making sure that we're bringing everybody up? We saw that slide earlier that showed a little over 83% of individuals that don't have a college degree. But how are we moving them to the middle class? How are we giving them um, middle class income so that they can provide for their families, so that they can move things forward? Right. One of the big things that we talked about in Assemblywoman Cheryl Brown is always an advocate for is, is how do we grow the economy here, but how are we doing those things, uh, especially for her geography, where you guys are located, the goods movement, logistics, this exploding field that's moving forward, right? And what are we doing moving forward? And I saw some of the things, and I really appreciate the key findings and what can we do. So it's not just we're talking about an issue, but how can we together collectively come together to actually make things work? How can we provide those opportunities? And this is a, a big emerging field that we continue to see double-digit um, growth, right? So when we're talking about moving things forward, and you know what's uh, kind of ironic is even for some of the folks that came in, we're arguing about the same thing. We all want a clean environment, and we're talking about how do we do those things, right? So if we're talking about bringing jobs and cleaning, we can do those things, right? If it's uh, electric forklifts, which we saw earlier today, right? If it's talking about how do you more efficiently move goods, because everybody in this room, we all have things that we're buying, whether it's online or the local store, right? We all have needs, whether it's clothing or whether it's books or whether it's... Um, you know, making sure our kids have a baseball mitt so they go play t-ball, right? We all have these needs. And so, um, one, I just want to say thank you guys for all being here, but just know that you do have a very strong advocate who's always advocating for you guys. I think the thing that we always hear from Assemblywoman Brown is, is my district, my district, my district. How does this help? How are we helping individuals? And it's really about empowering the families so that we can all collectively grow as a state and grow our economy. Mm -hmm.